So I just got off my last of my coaching calls for the day and uh, I wanted to highlight something for you. Uh, this, <laughs> a client of mine is going on holidays in tax season. Yes, that's right. Tim, you know who you are. That's right, he's gonna be gone for 11 days in March. 11 days, right in the middle of tax season, right in the shit storm, right in the middle of when most accountants are dying and uh, basically suffering. What the, the name of this video I was gonna ask, I was or I was gonna title it, uh, was February fun? Like, how was February? Was it fun? Because I talked to uh, quite a few accountants that aren't in the ASF program and they were suffering like you wouldn't believe. Um, a whole bunch of new tax changes and laws have changed in both both countries, Canada and the US. It just created even much more nightmare for everybody. But here, here's the thing. He's actually going on a holiday in March. Like in March. Like, is he nuts? Is he crazy? No. He's actually decided to do this because mostly, most accountants don't go on holidays in, in the springtime because it's the busy season. We just have to, this is what I call the third lie. We just accept that tax time has to suck, but it doesn't have to suck. You just need to take back control of your business model and decide what you want to do. Um, and I, I just, I'm really frustrated with the accounting profession and I'm frustrated with the victimhood that's going on. And it's the whole world really, like when it comes right down to it, I can go into a political slide here. More and more people are trying to point the finger at why they're not happy, why your life's not, why their life is not happy. It's that person's fault. It's this person's fault. Don't call me this, call me that. Because if you call me this, I'm going to be upset and you're oppressing me. And it's all like, I think it's all bullshit. Okay, honestly, that's my fact. That's my, my honest opinion on the whole thing is because it's a victim mentality. And victim mentality means that there's some oppressor that's holding you back from your life. And really, it's your life. It's totally your life. And you get to choose what you want to do with it. And that's what I want for accountants is to be able to take back control of their business model so they can take back control of their life. If you feel like a victim, you will constantly be under, you will have no control. You will have no empowerment. There'll be nothing you can do. And so I want I want you to think about that and go, because I know what I, just to let you know, it's not that I'm talking from a high horse here. I used to feel that way too. Like I felt horrible about it when I was articling and I was, I was working so hard to become a partner or we become a CPA and then CPA to become a partner. And then it was just a constant grind and my partners were holding me back and then my clients were complaining and then the government was giving new tax changes. It was constant victimhood all the way. Instead of just a complete acceptance for life the way it is, it's like, hmm, okay, this is the way life is. What? Can, but what can I do to change it? What can I do to change it? Well, Tim changed it. He took control of his business model. Now he's made it to the point where he actually can go away and have a week off in March to go spend it with his family. He's going to go down, have a great time. And you can have the same thing too. So I guess the overriding message here is I want you to just stop and ask yourself and saying, are you feeling like a victim? Are you feeling like Someone else has got control. Someone else has the rings of it. Maybe you work for an accountant and you're, well, I just, Eric, I have to because these are the numbers, these are the hours I have to put in. Well, you don't. You should see the great resignation that's just happened post-pandemic. Most accounting firms have people just like bleeding from them because they're taking off. But those accountants that are sticking around, you can actually choose how you want to do your business. You can choose what you want to get paid. You can choose what you do. Um, and it's totally up to you. I just want to empower you. I honestly, and I implore you, just want to empower you to take back control of your business model so you can take back control of your life. It's about you. And like I said, I just, I'm sick and tired of this victim mentality. It doesn't get you anywhere. It doesn't get you anywhere. Um, you're just going to end up in a spiral and there's a whole another psychological level that I could get into, but I've already rambled long enough for this week's video. So um, I'll just leave it, leave it to you with that. Um, just one last thing I wanted to share with you too. The Accountant Success Formula program, online program is free. I've had it free for a while now. I'm going to be turning it off. It's going to be turned off. It's not going to be free anymore. Um, and so for those of you that want to get in there, I highly recommend you claim your spot. You can get in there. Eventually, I'm going to probably start a group coaching program, but the free version is going to be turned off fairly soon. Um, and so if you want it, 
get in there and get access to it because, um, yeah, I'm going to turn it off. There you go. Anyways, there you go. Um, but as always, if you have any questions, please reach out, let me know, and I'd love to have a chat with you. So there you go. I'm Eric Solback, and reminding you that when you take back control of your business model, you can take back control of your life. Stay tuned for more success tips to come.